Get ready to take Wild Thing out for a spin with a few simple tips for you and your rider. Tip number one, you'll need to charge your 12 volt battery for at least 18 hours right out of the box, and then carefully install it on its side in the battery compartment. Plug the motor harness into the battery and you'll see the LED flash to let you know you have a proper connection. Tip number two. Okay, this baby takes a little getting used to. Left turns, right turns, spinning and stopping. That's why we recommend starting with a lower speed and then increasing speed with more driving experience. Here's how to change the speed. Press and hold the Smart Drive button. While holding the Smart Drive button, press the Speed Selection button. With each press, you'll change the speed. How do you know what speed you've selected? Look at the LED and count the number of flashes. Two flashes indicate you've set the speed at two miles per hour. Three flashes for three miles per hour, four flashes for four miles per hour, and five flashes for, you guessed it, five miles per hour. Tip number three. Now that you've set the speed, it's time for a test ride. Make sure your child is sitting as far back in the seat as possible. Wild Thing needs weight in the back of the seat to move. Push both joysticks forward to go straight ahead. Pull both joysticks backward to back up. Push the left joystick forward and keep the right joystick centered for a right turn. For a left turn, it's the opposite. Push the right joystick forward and keep the left joystick centered. Stopping is simple. Return the joysticks to their centered position. That's it. Last but not least, spinning. Push one joystick forward and pull the other joystick backward for twirling, whirling fun. Tip number four. Wild Thing's speed is kid-controlled, too. Ease the joystick forward or backward to go slower than the set speed for more steering control. Tip number five. Did Wild Thing stop unexpectedly? It's probably time to charge the battery. Remove the seat and check the LED. Do you see three slow flashes followed by three fast flashes? Yup, that's the low battery indicator. Time for a recharge. Now you're ready to get wild with fast straightaways, tight turns, and awesome 360-degree spins. Power Wheels Wild Thing, the only way to ride.